Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Enigma and you're watching Enigma Inc. So let's do Capricorn. And this is going to be as usual a general reading. Take what resonates, leave what does not. For personal readings and more accuracy, you can book me on WhatsApp or Instagram me. And follow me on Instagram for updates, offers, manifestation tips, guidance daily horoscopes and much more subscribe to my youtube channel for more such videos capricorn sun moon rising and venus sign you can check out your sun moon rising and venus sign in the comment section sorry in the description section uh, section below all right so capricorn wow capricorn what's happening with you guys you are in a very happy cheery you know cheerful energy I see like uh, you're having fun wherever you are, enjoying your own time. You are not bothered by anybody. You just want to have time for self-love. You just want to spend time for self, you know. Okay, fine. So I feel like Capricorns, there is just someone, maybe a cancer person, a Sagittarius Leo person who wants to reach out to you. It feels like uh, the moment they left you, they've started feeling very burdened because you are nowhere to be found, all right? And this person feels, I feel like your person is having a lot of struggle in their life, so they really want to reach out to you and, you know, balance their own life because you were like a perfect balance for this person. Yeah, your person is drowning in emotions, so your person is feeling very, very droned and sad and depressed and this could be a Scorpio person maybe not many things are not going properly in their life maybe that is the reason why they are too on and off or they appear to be distant because they don't want to share with you what all they are going through they see you in a very happy energy right now Capricorn they see you as someone who has everything sorted like you have all the things set in place and you have new things to explore so there are no limitations in your life and you're like exploring and you know with the circle and with the circle here you are limitless so you have limitless um, opportunities for you whereas this person is completely droning like when it comes to love that's also very burdening for them when it comes to relationship career everything is just feeling like they don't know what to do you know they're always confused so this could be a scorpio or a cancer a sagittarius leo person i feel like they are having a tough time and i feel like uh, maybe this person is right now not in contact with you so if that is so they really want to reach out to you and talk to you you know and just you know get those good vibes from you because this person is not doing well so re they're really missing you they're really thinking about you and wants to reach out this could be just a friend also not just a lover this could be a friend also someone who's traveling a lot maybe that is why they are drained out so much and they really want to talk to you and you know feel good and spending time with you would really make them feel energized this is someone who could be an Aquarius or a Pisces person. I feel like uh, more so I feel this person is someone who's sensitive, emotional. They're ready to take this risk to reach out to you because their intuition is guiding them, them to do so. Also because you want them back or you want them to reach out to you. Okay, This could be a new person for some of you. But I do see this happening like uh, they are going to intuitively take a leap of faith towards you and reach out to you like you will be like wow out of blue this this guy or this girl reached me or someone reached me you were not expecting this person to reach out and i do see they may be reaching out with flowers they may reaching out with something more than just friendship this time maybe they would ask you for a date maybe they would ask you to just you know spend some time with them and get to know them more however you will be pretty uh, defensive you will stop yourself from re uh, you know reciprocating those feelings you will be guarded because you know what they did in the past okay so you won't make it easy for this person all right uh yeah, I feel like your person is pretty emotional towards you these days or they're simply having a lot of emotional stuff happening in their life right now. 
yes so i do see like uh this person will struggle to get your attention the way you were giving them before but uh, you somehow are going to stick to what you feel is right you won't give in to this person you will stick to what you feel and uh, i do see your energy is very important for you capricorn and you always stick to what feels right for you so with the four of pentacles i feel like you don't want to give in or you don't want to share all your secrets about your goals about your future about a lot of things with this person anymore you don't want to give more efforts you don't want to put more efforts into this connection okay and uh, i feel like this person's fighting for your attention too much here is such there is leo for some yes <laughs> and okay your person is continuously watching you whoever it is that you had crush on you still have a crush on i don't know but yes there is an energy that's continuously keeping a close watch on you and i feel like you are focusing on yourself capricorn you are growing and they're really very surprised how you're taking care of yourself loving yourself growing rising you know from the ashes and literally not bothered about who cares who doesn't so capricorn you have a lot in the plate and you got to grab it because i see like lot of opportunities with the circle here with the circle here and with the circle here it's your energy capricorn what i feel is that you are going to complete your goal very very soon and you are going to stand out successful and this person will appreciate that in the end they will be the one standing in the crowd clapping for you the clapper okay so this could be libra gemini aquarius for some but yes this person is continuously keeping a close watch on you and really wants your attention however you're not focused you are started to you know release this person and uh, I feel like you've decided and you're working on it you're working to move on from this connection because it was not giving you the kind of respect or value you deserve so you decided to leave because there was so much darkness with this person you were dealing with a dark person or someone who doesn't like to be open uh, with feelings or who didn't give you what you were expecting this could be a virgo person as well i feel like uh, they feel alone they feel left out in the cold or they simply are just uh, sitting alone and analyzing and trying to get the enlightenment about what all happened in the past with you and how they could correct things up so they're trying to align things for the better with you they're trying to correct things with you they would want to justify and they want the the patch up to happen you know that's that's the kind of energy i'm getting this person is keeping see as i told you ace of pentacles now ace of pentacles is telling me clearly that they really want another chance with you okay they want to uh grow and they they see a potential in this connection and they don't want to ruin this opportunity so yeah this person is also bringing some kind of a relationship opportunity like let's start afresh let's come on let's forget the past and start off afresh with this solid uh foundation so i do see this person is thinking about a solid foundation with you now Virgo Taurus Capricorn they were the one who never wanted to commit and now they want to see Ace of Cups yes there is a lot of love coming in so this person wants a new beginning they feel emotional they want you back they want that energy that you once you know spread the kind of aura positivity you spread around this person they miss that because this person doesn't have a habit of enjoying or you know feel it, feel positive so you kind of brought that for them i feel like uh, they just wish that may this wish of having my capricorn back come true because i do see this is them and this is you whereas you have so many opportunities and options in different fields for you to manifest and you already manifested a lot and you're happy about your growth and are happy about your outcome you're taking care of yourself but this person whoever it is libra gemini aquarius or could be any sign for that matter is a uh, feeling is wishing is begging for your attention because this person is not getting what they want this is you this person is see the difference between you two so they are like wishing to god to fulfill their wish they're wishing to god to ease their life to comfort comfort their life they're wishing to god for you so they want you back okay they're trying to manifest you not by the magic and all 
but yes they're like wishing that they have you okay so this is light this is dark so it's like that the contrasting situation so you're dealing with someone who's completely opposite of yours so i don't think this is gonna work okay yes yeah, see your person's feeling left out in the cold you close the door and uh, there's no key so there's a key here okay i feel like you close the door and you have the uh, you know choice to open the door for this person okay now you have this choice but you are still closing it keeping it closed okay and this person is feeling bad it doesn't bother you you're not uh, it's not your responsibility you're not his mother or you're not her mother or father you know so this person has to take an action they need to apologize they need to talk to you and they need to be at their best self they need to value you they need to respect you they have to put up the best game to impress you that's how you should go okay all right so what are they going to do for my caps let's see what are they going to do okay hmm. almost all laid out <laughs> the cards thing all right so i do feel like this person sees you as someone who left left the picture altogether so they will try to settle down without you however this is not going to work and they will reach out to you i feel like they are going through some deep trouble so they will reach out but it's going to be a slow process so if you're wondering no they haven't reached out yet it's going to take a lot of time you till that time you just keep on working on yourself that is very important Let me see what in love is coming for you. Forgiving. See, I told you this person will ask for forgiveness. They will ask you. They will try to justify, clarify their situation so that you take them back. Deception. This is a person that you you cannot trust. Okay. So they're doing it for their own convenience. So don't fall for it. And I feel like yes, I told you there's there's a deception in the trust. There was no trust, so the situation ended like anything unrequited love situation. This person is just wanting you to buy be by their side. It's nothing like love. If you feel like maybe this person has fallen in love, it's just for the short period of time because they are going through some rough phase and they want you. They dependent on you, being dependent on someone. because they are used to you doesn't mean that they're in love with you so that's kind of dependency that they feel towards you and it's like done and over with they're done and over with no no you are done and over with you need to be trust is very essential for my caps so this person is not the one that you can trust don't let the pride get in your way full moon in leo so yeah let me see why did it say that I see your person could be a Leo person. There may be an ego battle between you guys also, so don't let the ego, you know, come up too much. The end of the tough cycle approaches. So I feel like this is the ending. Finally, there is going to be a peaceful resolution. You will get a closure finally, and then there is moving on. Finally, and realizing there is some someone new in your life. Now I want to see. who in love is coming next for my caps all right so i feel like there's a third party reaching out to you but first you really need to focus on self for 3 months at least you're going to focus on self very soon i feel like if you separate from someone who's completely dragging you you need to um you know focus on self and distract yourself from any kind of love or situation stuff like that this is going to happen very fast that you will be you know a potential uh, person to woo for these people so yeah you are going to get a lot of um uh, you know uh, crushes so there will be a lot of crushes a lot of options reaching out to you and you get to decide who you want that is also there Let me see from Aries to Pisces. Let me know in the comment section if you want Aries to Pisces thing in all the readings, okay? And do drop a like if it's resonating with you. So yeah, I want to do some Aries to Pisces stuff. I feel like you will be the boss here. You see, you you feel like wow, everything is happening in my favor. What just happened? I don't know. 
so you kind of you will be the boss but don't let the pride get in the way just uh, think in a very balanced way okay so you may end up rejecting the good match also so don't do that be very much in your senses while you are the boss here aries her feelings towards you aries Aries is keeping a close watch however they feel like you have moved on and it's been too late for them Taurus Taurus is having crush on you and they were wondering what is the right time to reach out to you so they will reach on the right time Gemini Gemini enter the situation they're done with it they're moving on Cancer Cancer is in love with you they want something solid this could be a same sex relationship or someone who you know uh, sees you like a best friend also this could be a situation as well leo okay wait all right so leo is having a very strong attraction towards you they want to reach out to you but don't do not fall for it too fast because this could get into a this could be an on and off stuff happening here virgos okay virgo is confused they don't know what action to take okay Virgo is confused and I also see like uh, this Virgo is also not opening emotionally they do want to communicate they do want the stability to happen however they will be very guarded so it will be difficult for you or they are already feeling very guarded Libra is stuck on you I feel like they were wondering about a long term future however it didn't work out maybe you left them and they feel shattered Scorpio Scorpio sees you as a wish fulfillment they see you as someone who is the best match for this person Sagittarius Sagittarius is in love with you they want to reach out they see you as they see a potential with you they feel like a boss when you're around them you know you give them a kind of a you know nudge or you give them a kind of an ego boost so yeah Capricorn Capricorn is uh this could be your energy as well okay i feel like the caps need to really work on themselves because there is need to be a healing happening here i feel like your uh, your capricorn feels rejected or blocked by someone so you need healing or they need healing aquarius okay aquarius is uh, having a huge 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 crush on you they feel like you're the best option out of all of these so they're open to options as well pisces pisces wants to keep it professional due to some reason maybe you hurt them in the past so now they want to just keep it professional with you so yeah that's about it capricorn i hope you've enjoyed it do not forget to like this video if you want more such videos and do drop comments and let me know how you want uh, more videos to be like and share and subscribe bye take care